Hi everyone, this is Anil. In this video, we'll talk about how to fix IRE partial payload errors. Uh, this video is part of uh, Varan Awesome Now CMDB data load video series. So let's look at the payload we're trying to load uh, into ServiceNow. Now this payload has uh, three items. There are two CIs and one relationship. Now the output of this uh, data load should be that it should either create or update these uh, two CIs. One is network port one is IP address, and then it should create a relationship between this network port and IP address. The relationship type will be owns owned by where network port owns IP address. Now let's load this and see what happens. To load a payload, you have to navigate uh, to this through these steps. First, you go to configuration, identification, reconciliation, and select identification simulation. Then we select start with existing payload and provide the payload that is giving errors. So I navigate to the platform and then select identification simulation and select start with existing payload. Here I select data source as warrant, provide the payload and run simulation. So when you do that, you can see that it has attempted to run this payload and it has given one error. So I select input, which is the input that we have given. Now. On this screen, you cannot scroll down, so which means either you have to copy the whole content into a mode pad and see, or you can zoom out also and see, right? Now you click on logs to see what is the error. So if you select log, you can see that there's a missing dependency in the payload. So it says no relations defined for dependent class CMDBCI IP address that matches any containment hosting rules uh, with either IP address or cloud DB cluster or uh, RHVBM instance or cloud uh, database and so on. So basically these are the existing uh, hosting rules defined for this IP address. Now how do we change this? To do that we will go to metadata editor, configuration, identification, reconciliation, metadata editor. When you click on that, uh, you will see three options, containment rules, hosting rules, reference rules. So under hosting rules, if you select IP address, you will see that these are the hosting rules already configured. Now let's take a look at hardware hosting rule. So you can see that configuration type is hardware, relationship type is owns owned by and reverse relationship direction is checked. Now let's cancel this. We'll make a new hosting rule with a network port. To do that, click on add hosting rule. There's a small plus button and then select network port. Relationship type is owns owned by and reverse relationship direction is checked. Click on create. So once you do that, it will create a new hosting rule between network port and IP address. Let's give it a minute and then we can check again. So you can see now there are seven hosting rules. There is one for network port. Now we can open and see that the configuration type is network port, relationship type is owns owned by, and reverse relationship direction is checked. Now let's go back and try the simulation again. So go to simulation, navigate to configuration, identification, reconciliation, identification simulation. So here we'll start with existing payload. Now provide the payload, select the data source as warrant and run simulation. Now you will see that there are no errors. And if you expand this in the logs, um, let's give it a minute to do it. So there are no errors, so you don't see anything in the log. And now let's look at the output. So in the output, you will see that for class network port, it is doing an insert. And similarly, uh, for class IP address, it is doing an insert and then also see relations and then here also it is doing an insert so again as we discussed initially the outcome of this data load should be either it has to create update network port create update IP address and create update relationship and that is what it is doing here uh, let's do a quick recap this video is about uh, resolving or fixing partial payload errors when you are doing data loads now, in this example, we are looking at network port and IP address. 
as we have seen when you're trying to load this payload we are getting the partial payload errors so to fix that so to fix that we have added uh, uh, hosting rule between network port and IP address and then ran the simulation post which uh, the load was successful or uh, the simulation uh, showed, shows that there are no errors and it is trying it, it is trying to insert network port IP address and relationship thank you for watching this is Anil